Hey guys, good morning. We're gonna take a look at uh, uh, Zechariah 8 today. Uh, God is giving us this cool, awesome picture of uh, Jerusalem. Uh, my Bible uh, titles it Jerusalem, Holy City of the Future. And you see, um, you, you know, as you're reading this this here, uh, it, it looks like a poem to me that it, it's uh, Jerusalem. Jerusalem's going to be the place to be. It's going to be, uh, uh, you know, all it's it's verse four says, "Old men and women shall sit against, shall sit in the streets of Jerusalem, each one with a staff in his hand, because of the great age." So, uh, you know, you see that people are growing old safely. And in verse five, the streets of this city are filled with boys and girls playing in the streets, and you know, you you picture that as as being safe and being secure, and and you know, being a place maybe where you would want to be. And, you know, as, as you read down and, and you know, you see all, all the great things that God is going to uh, accomplish there. God is going to be there. And I love the way this chapter ends. It says, verse 23, thus says the Lord of hosts, In those days ten men from every language of the nation shall grasp the sleeve of a Jewish man, saying, Let us go with you, for we have heard that God is with you. You know, and I just picture that in my mind. Um... You know, it's so different than what we have today. You know, today, it, it seems the world just wants to kill a Jewish man just because they're Jewish, just because they come from Israel. And and, and this is just such a contrasting picture, you know, where, where everybody will want to go there. And, you know, I'm not saying that God is not with Israel now. Um, um, I'm saying that how much more will God be? You know, in the days when he brings this peace, in the day when all of the, this fighting and all of this stuff is over, in the day when New Jerusalem comes, and, and if you read, you want to know a little more about New, New Jerusalem, read Revelation 21, and I'll tell you, it, it gives a great picture um, of of the, the stones and, and gems that he uses to build it, and uh, the size. I mean, the New Jerusalem, it's, it's going to be uh, from... Miami to Boston, that, that's how large this one city is going to be from Miami to Boston all the way to Texas. You know, it's going to be huge, huge, 2,000 miles up, 2,000 miles wide, huge, one city. And, and you see here all the peace and, and just how people are getting along. And, and it, it says over here in, in uh, um, And one of the verses, it says that, that people won't be lying to each other and people will be treating each other with justice. And man, that's a place I want to be. That's a place I want to be. So please read, read a little more into it. Read Revelation 21 and, and let your imagination go. God gave you that imagination so you can dream of great things after him. Use it. Have a great day, guys. I love you all.